Hey guys, today I will give you a tutorial on how to make this potly bag. Your end result will be very beautiful. This is how it's going to look like. So beautiful. So beautiful. That's how it's going to look like. So let's get started. I have 8 mm pearls, 4 mm metallic beads, and 8 mm black pearls. The pliers and 50 pound fish line. Put six beads on the line and go through the last bead. Now we have the thread in one, so all we have to do is to add five because this stitch takes six, six bead. Five bead. Go to the next bead. Now add four beads. Go to the next bead again. Four beads. Go to the next bead again and add four. next bead and pick up four beads Go to the middle bead and the side bead. It ends in three. Pick up three beads. Okay, that is how it should look like when you complete that stage. Now go through the next bead again. And pick up four beads. into the next bead pick up three 
on this stage is six five six five round into the next bead go to the middle bead and the side bead pick up three into the next bead pick up three see how the pattern is going six five six five six five all round the bees go through the middle bead and the side bead now you pick up three that is how we are going to do it to every single bead until we complete the circle okay i'm coming to the end of the circle that is how it should look like pick up two bees and end it so now my thread is facing up on this stage we are going to add Six bees. While your thread remain in two, make sure your thread remain in two. Go to the next next bead. Add four bees. And the trail made in two, two bees. I'll go to the next bead. Pick up four. Next bead. And pick up four. Okay, this is how it's looking so far. The next bead. Four. Okay. 
this is how it should look like now we are going to do it to every single bead until we complete the circle okay now I complete my circle and my thread is up and I'm ending in two beads I'll go through the next bead. Add four beads. Go to the next bead. Add three beads. into the next bead add three beads And the next two, next two, next two, next two. We are picking two, two on the top to complete the circle. Okay, I'll complete it and end up in two bees. Two bees. So over here, we are going to do the normal weave. So add the bee, three bees on the line and cross it with the next one and pull this stage is just a normal weave normal 444 weave that we are going to do and build on it to make the bag the next bead go to the next bead add two bead It needs to be, go through the next bead. And add two bead. Next bead. And add to B. That is how we are going to continue build on it to make the bag the same weave. Next bead and add to B.
do the same thing to all of them all round yeah i've finished with the round so my thread is up and i'm coming through i'm going to go through the middle bead and the side bead middle bead and the side bead over here i only need one bead so my thread can face up come to the top so i can continue the weaving just like that so on that add one gold bead this is where we are going to add the golden bead in between the boxes one gold bead and three pearls now add one gold bead and go through the next bead go to the next bead add two pearls two pearls so anytime you want to go through a bead add the gold bead remember to add the gold bead before you go through the bead that's all i'm doing add two pearls that is how it's going to continue the same with the same adding of beads see how it's taking shape already remember to add gold bead to go through every bead that you're going through So that is how we are going to do it you see how it's taking place the shape already we're going to go all around and build on it to make a big bucket here i'm just adding black bead the black round bead that i show you that's what i'm adding and it's the same weave the same weave. i'm just building on the white pearl the same weave I'm going to do it until I get 13. I'll do the black, maybe five rows and another white on top until I get 13 in all. So I'm just showing you that I'm adding the black bead to it. Okay, here I am. I completed. I made I come up 13 in all, and 13 in counts. So now the thread is up. I'm going through the next bead. I'm going to add six beads to the line. Make sure your thread remain in two bees. So pick up another two, two bees. Now add four.
make sure your thread remain in two bees now pick up another two and add four bead another two add four bees so that is how we're going to do it pick up another two and add four bees that is how we're going to weave it and complete the top circle because that is where we are going to pull our thread through always make sure your thread remains in two b go to two 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 and add four until you complete it now i'm on a completing side so what I, i'll put the thread through all those beads the next bead because that is the last row. i i have the bead on both sides so i don't have to add more beads what i have to do is to go through all and add only two beads yeah now what we're going to do the next is four five four five four add five five b go to the next one the top you are going to pick only one one bead and go through all the next bead and add two because it's five four five four go to the next one and add three here I just want to throw in some black bees just random bees next one pick up two Yeah, that is how we're going to do it all round. Go to the next bead. If you do five, you do four. That is the pattern, five, four, five, four. We have the thread in two already. So what we have to do is to add three beads. Well, that is how we're going to do it all around first let me show you the bead string that I made it's a bead string that I will use to go through the holes all around so guys that is how our finished products look like 
so pretty you can pull it and tie it I pull it through you can tie it look at how beautiful it looks those are the loose thread I want to clean up well I'll just clean it up that's it that's all that's how the finished products look like everybody can do it thanks for watching and